I'm going to introduce you to a rather remarkable man. He's Mr. Michael Fitzpatrick from Killeney, Maynooth. Now, he started to draw the old age pension in 1927. And seven years ago, he got the president's bounty on his 100th birthday. Now, he's from County Clare. He came up from Clare in 1940 to a land commission farm in Maynooth, where he lives now. You have seen a lot of changes, Mr Fitzpatrick, in farming. What would you say was the biggest change? Well, machinery. And what sort of a machine uh, would well, you think that made the biggest impression? Well, <coughs> well, the reaper and binder is a great one, but by God, the one for cutting up the ground and throwing a crop is a powerful one to one. Well, you were, you were saying you're, at, at the time you saw the mowing machine first, it, it made a tremendous impression on you. It did. Because it didn't run, how could it be done at all? What was the the reaction of the people at that time to the mower machine, Mr. Fitzpatrick? A great many of them wasn't minding it and could afford it, but more of them got at it. And some of them, I think you told me, uh, wouldn't have it on the land at all? Well, that had a good father, but I would say about our town's land, he wouldn't have allowed it in it. He used to pay a mint to cut it at three and six months a day. Do you, do you remember uh, c uh, cutting the harvest with the reaping hook? Oh, it was, it was all of it. Cut for years and years and years, not years, but cut it. And how do you think that the reaping hook compares with the combine at the present time? Oh, well, there's an awful.